All right, everyone, joined here by manager Bud Black. We'll go ahead and lead off with Kevin. Go ahead, Kevin. Hey, buddy, it looked like uh, Austin's slider was his main weapon today until that one that he hung. Is that what you were seeing as well? Yeah, he had a good slider today. Uh, unfortunately, threw the one bad one to, to wait for him in the fifth, but uh, I thought he threw the ball well. Uh, seven strikeouts through four and two thirds, mix of pitches, uh, you know, a couple hard contacts, but overall, I, you know, I thought. He was fine. Just the, you know, the, uh, you know, the fifth inning came back to bite him, and does. The triple was hit down the line. Did that just take a bad carry him off the ball? Or you know, it's such a it's sort of tricky down there. That, you know, if you know Connor has a couple different ways to play that. Uh, you know, it looked like he tried to smother it a little bit and sort of trap it against the wall, or he could try to. Glove it. I mean, you're on the run. The, the ball's bouncing. You don't know, you know, you know the ricochet is going to take off the bricks. You know, it was one of those where he converged with the ball and the wall and uh, his body, and it, you know, it got by him. It's, uh, you know, sort of a, you know, really a, sort of a tricky play for him. And the last one for me, I know uh, Kinley came in with three strikeouts against the five batters he faced as well. Uh, was that some of the best stuff you've seen from him so far this year? Well, you know, he, he keeps his, uh, you know, he holds his stuff pretty well throughout the season. I think we've seen the, the same uh, velocity through the course of the year. Uh, it looked a little crisper today. He's, he's had a few days off, which has, you know, benefited him. Uh, what I like today, uh, there was a change up in there at, at 85 miles an hour. There was a, a different shape to a breaking ball in there. It was, there was an 85 mile an hour breaking ball that he did uh, by design uh, to all contra uh, that had, you know, had the depth of, and the look of a curveball. So, you know, we talked about that after his inning and, you know, something that he's been, I wouldn't say experimenting with, but, you know, working on it, uh, you know, early in the afternoon, you know, just trying to get a little different shape and maybe a little speed variance, uh, you know, on his on his breaking pitches. So that was good to see. But he, I mean, he threw the ball fine, threw aggressive, uh, live fastball, and a good hard breaking pitch. Thanks, buddy. Daniel, next, go ahead, Daniel. Yeah, buddy, what went into the decision to switch Gombar and Marquez today? Uh, I, well, I, no, I didn't, uh, you know, I didn't speak to that last night. I think I spoke to uh, Jack Corrigan. I think, uh, Daniel, basically, without going into a, a, a whole lot of details in the mental aspect of it, uh, you know, Gomber, uh, in his mind, mentally was set to throw the day game today as scheduled if we were to play last night. Uh, you know, Marquez was set to throw the night game uh, last night, wanted to keep him on that night uh, night game type schedule and keep Gomber on the on this daytime schedule where both mentally they, uh, you know, I think pitched the game they thought they were supposed to pitch. Uh, and I do think the last couple of games, I think that Marquez is uh, pitching a double header. He pitched the first game and I think the results have been a little rough. So we decided to give him a little different look. Thank you. You're welcome. We're going to Ryan Herrera next. Go ahead, Ryan. Uh, hey, buddy, uh, just real quick on Connor Joe. Obviously, he felt good enough to stay in the game after that collision in the outfield, but, I mean, that, that's it's kind of a big body to run into. How's he feeling? He's feeling fine. You're right. Uh, you know, two guys with, you know, decent size and put together a uh, collision. Uh, you know, Connor wore the brunt of that one, but, uh, you know, as we went out there and checked him, he, you know, could feel better and, uh, you know, the little – frogginess that uh, occurred after contact lessened and he felt he felt fine he, you know he felt fine as the game went on so he's gonna he's in there in the second game in left field tonight thank you yeah. any last questions for buddy